Han Automation is a global specialized machine builder placed in the automotive, consumer goods, and healthcare industries. The market of specialized machine building is quite unique. Sometimes customers approach us and they already know exactly what they want, which makes our job very easy. But as specialized machine builders, we really thrive on the opportunity to learn with the customer. When the customer came to us with the challenge of riveting and punching their heat shields, we worked closely with their engineers, developing on the fly the process that's required in order to achieve, first of all, their quality, but also their cycle time. We were given the challenge of developing the entire process of manufacturing the parts. And in this cell, there's seven variants of parts, both large and small, various shapes and sizes. We had to make sure that every cell could produce every part. The rivet, it was a main challenge for us. The rivet is very flexible, so you can't just go down and grab it. So we had to grab it in multiple places to support it so the robot can engage in different steps and pull that rivet in. The place where the rivet has to get in has to really work its way in and in between the press and the part, it's just really challenging to get to that. So it took a lot of studies in mechanical design and in programming and working together as teams to figure out the best solution. We prefer KUKA's robots for a couple of reasons. First, we have a very good relationship with KUKA. Secondly, KUKA has a more advanced controller than the other competitors. We really like the flexibility in the programming language. It's almost really open source for us so that we can talk to the PLC, talk robot to robot, and create our own solution to achieve what we need to do. Normally, if we have multiple robots in a cell, they do not occupy the same space. In order to meet their cycle time, we're required to have both robots moving at the same time while preventing collisions. The capability of the controllers allowed us to have the two robots interface very tightly to coordinate their motion, and that capability gives us a lot of benefits. It's a cell that's flexible for long term for the customer. By using robots and two robots working together, it makes the possibilities infinite for the customer with all their different parts in the future. They can produce far more parts in a shorter amount of time. It also requires very little manual labor. The operator simply loads the parts, presses an opto button, the robots come up, pick it up, and they complete the part and place it back in the load station. So a single operator can control any cell. Over the next five years, we're going to continue to push the use of robots, the use of collaborative robots, the assembly and test equipment, along with really flexible solutions and operator-friendly equipment. The future for robotics and automation is fantastic. As an employee, you get to work on building machines, answering challenges that you may not even know exist today. I believe this industry is on a great growth path into the future.